in one of my earlier videos I showed you how to paint the eyes on uh, humans so today I'm going to show you how to paint eyes on dragons um, so let's get on now you can see I've already base coated the dragon um, done some work on his teeth um, there's still a lot to do um, but um, the first thing we need to do is cover the eye white so it gives us a good strong um, base coat to work on I'm using just uh, ordinary matte white from Army Painter for my base coat I'm using uh, Army Painter Character Brush. Um, I really, really love the Army Painter range of brushes uh, because I've got quite big hands. And as you can see, the stem is quite thick, which means you get, I get a better grip of the brush. And that's really important. Okay. So we're just giving the eye a nice coat of white, so we have something to work on. And the white will really bring out the colour. Once the white has dried, uh, we can move on to the next stage. Um, I'm using Candlelight Yellow from Reaper Miniatures, uh, MSP paints. Um, a little tip when uh, you use these paints is give them a shake and turn the bottle upside down. Uh, all the pigments will then mix more thoroughly through the bottle. So, all we're doing is going over the white with the yellow paint. And because we painted white underneath, it really helps bring out the yellow for the eye. Again, don't worry about mistakes as we will go round the eye with a darker colour now that the yellow has dried we can start putting in the black I'm using an old Chaos Black from Gaines Workshop from the early 90s classic paints uh, old just like me <laughs> so what we need is um, a fine detail brush. I'm using Insane Detail Army Painter brush, which are amazing. And all you do is put some tiny, tiny amount of paint on your brush. What you're trying to get the look of is like a, a cat's eye um, so what you're doing is a straight line through the eye from the top going all the way across in a slightly curved angle like so very simple but effective and again, 
on the other side. Start from the top and just straight line across like so. Now what we do is we put the black all the way round which covers our mistakes and darkens the area which will bring out the light for the eye. So moving from the top all the way around and the same with the bottom so And again on the other side, we shall put black from the top. All the way around the eye. Now that we've got all the eyes painted, uh, there's one last thing we can do to really make the eyes stand out. And that is to give it um, a little coat of gloss varnish. So um, we're going to use some gloss and just paint over the eyes with a little bit of gloss varnish. So all we need for this is one nasty cheap paintbrush. All you need to do now is cover the eye with a little dab of the gloss varnish. The varnish um, looks very cloudy when you first paint it onto the miniature. But once it's dry, it'll go completely clear. So we'll do that for the rest of the miniatures. And then we'll come back and I'll show you what the finished eye looks like. Now the varnish is finished, drying, you can see the eye in more detail. So I'm quite happy with that. So there you are. That's a very simple way of doing dragon's eyes. And you can use you can use this method for any monster or creature 